Colorado. If gravity is love of Earth, the mountains teach us how to fly and bring us back as rivers flow. We never need to wonder why the wild will take your breath away. That's how it is in Colorado. I love her dreaming ranges, marmot rocks, and columbine. I love the rush of mountain air, snow pluming off the peaks and top knots of the pines, the quiet everywhere. The great rivers get up and grow. They carry the top soil of the soul to the primal ocean far below. I love the bluebird and the whiskey jack, the black bear and the antelope, the cattle drive, the buffalo. I love the canyons of the ancient ones. Maybe they've vanished. Maybe they've never gone. Remember them among their dwellings. Pinion, cliff, and watchful crow. The painted hands and animals. Coyote's canny, covert lope. The mesas and the grasslands. The Spanish names. The Ute, Cheyenne, Arapaho. The fancy dancer, Indian flute. The story waiting to be told is old, is new, is now, is Colorado. I love the switchback trail, the wide brim shading a rancher's eyes, the cat you never see that sees you under the bluest ever skies. Step out on a dare and see, you've come here for the freedom, just like me. To camp above 10,000 feet is to breathe the air of gods and drink with rainbow trout. Some come out west to beat the odds and find out that the sky's the limit. Some simply stare, no end to it. The way you can love a land and quite a few of the people in it. Give me the sage and sunlight, warm even in winter. Give me the moonlit snow. Give me the book cliffs and the farms, the wildflowers of Colorado.